Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today Mark my funny zombie has once again chucked us into a village We have no idea what he wants us to do Well, let's go and investigate what's going on today because I need to find out what's going on Mark my funny zombie always has such crazy adventures for us that the villagers are starting to hate me Hello villagers. How's it going? Do you guys know what do we want to do today? There's a giant chest Hmm, that's really strange well, let's go and find out what's going on because apparently there's a giant chest in this village. Gosh, this is so big and it seems like these villagers have gotten used to it. Well, let's find out what's inside because if a chest is this big, you must be able to fit everything you could ever want inside this world. Wait, did you guys hear that explosion? I have a feeling the villagers are already experimenting on crazy stuff. Well, let's go and find out what's inside because... <gasps> It's an emerald chest. They've gone ahead and put every single emerald they could find inside this crazy chest. And it does seem like this chest can fit everything we could ever want in the whole world. Well, I love this so much. And the sound it makes is absolutely crazy. Look! Whoa! <laughs> Imagine being stuck inside. You'll never be able to lift that thing ever again. Now, the villagers are calling me to go ahead and find out what's inside a chest right inside this village. Hello! How's it going? Is this house yours? Oh, it is! And they've gone ahead and written me a book. Well, let's see what it says. Hello, Naveed. We needed a bigger chest for all of our emeralds. We would give you some if you managed to destroy all the creepers inside of the chest. Enjoy, don't die. Wait. Are they scared I'm going to die? <laughs> this is going to be crazy. Because I did notice how many spawners were inside this chest. And I have a feeling that's got something to do with the explosion we just heard. I have a feeling they're going ahead and testing out some new creepers. And if we don't test them out ourselves, we could easily die. Well, I'm definitely ready. So I'm going to go ahead and start spawning these. And I am have a feeling that if we possibly kill all the villagers, we could easily go ahead and keep every single emerald inside this giant chest. Well, let's do this. I'm going to spawn three ghostly creepers. Cool! <laughs> and they started to levitate. That was super strange. And I think there's another one right inside here. Let's have a quick look. Is it gone? I, I think it's accidentally died. I think it was stuck inside this cobblestone. But I'm not really sure. Let me just go and break this and hopefully we can figure out if it's inside or not. Villager, did you see that fire? Okay, I don't think he wants to cooperate with me. He seems very confused today. Well, let's not waste any more time and let's go and spawn the Polar Creeper. Oh, they're going ahead and throwing snowballs. And when they blow up, they turn the ground into beautiful snow. <laughs> oh, poor villager. He probably hates it so much. His wonderful village has now gone ahead and been changed. Well, I guess this is pretty good. Sadly, villager, I do need some of your food because we're very quickly losing a lot of our health. Let's go see if we can actually grow some more of these potatoes and hopefully we can eat some ourselves and regain our health. Okay, let's do this. Perfect and good. And let's keep on eating up. There we go. And awesome. Thank you, villager. You are super cool. Well, guys, let's go spawn three armored creepers that I have a feeling these guys are going to go ahead and get even bigger than the chest right behind us. Are you ready? Here they go. They should start to expand. Are they? Oh, there they go. <laughs> yes, I knew they'd get bigger. Here we go. They're going to blow. Okay, I have a feeling we're going to lose every single one of our villagers in this crazy explosion. Gosh, there goes most of the chest. And look, they've gone ahead and broken the chest up into different pieces. That is so sad. Whatever's left of this crazy chest is now almost diminished. Look, it's such a big explosion. Well, I guess there goes all the emeralds. We'll never be able to see any of them ever again. Well, let's also go and spawn some of the hell creepers. Cool! Now, I wish they went ahead and added these creepers into the nether. It would be so cool. But I have a feeling that these poor villagers would hate it so much if they made their way into the real world. Okay, these poor villagers are probably hating me so much right now. And even though he's on fire, he's still farming. <laughs> this guy is devoted to this village so much. Do you know what? He deserves to live. Okay, let's go and spawn. The Spore Creeper. Now, I'm going to spawn this slightly away from the village because I actually feel sorry for that villager. Let's do it right here. Oh, cool. Wait, there's four little mini ones. No, and they've given us nausea. Oh, this is awful. <laughs> I can barely even see right now. Okay, they've gone ahead and created a little storm right above us. 
with so many crazy nausea effects. Okay, I'm just gonna wait until all these explosions finish off. Well, this has been a crazy day so far, so let me go ahead and spawn some shaman creepers? Okay, I'm not really sure if these guys are friendly or not. I've never been able to figure it out. These villagers have maybe created such abominable creepers that sometimes I'm unsure what they're trying to do. Look, it seems like the little... Okay, are they just trying to kill themselves? <laughs> Whatever's going on, these guys are super weird. So do you know what? I'm going to leave them there. I'm going to spawn the blazing creeper. Gosh, these guys are so cute. But when they blow up... They turn that whole world into lava! I knew it! <laughs> okay, this is such a crazy day. They're now blowing up. Wait, why is all the villagers on fire? Even the ones inside the house. No! I hope these guys don't die. Okay, let me maybe go ahead and create a house for them so they will never have to escape ever again. I doubt these villagers need a lot of food. Okay, villagers, I'm so sorry. I'm going to go and create a little block for you guys and hopefully you should be able to keep safe. Just stay away from all the lava. Okay, I think we've destroyed this village a bit too much now. So let's go ahead and go and spawn the musical creepers. There we go. <laughs> yes! Whoa! This is almost like a nightmare I've had. These guys are super scary. Gosh! Okay, I'm so glad we've gone ahead and killed those and we pretty much got rid of them. Well, let's keep on going. And I'm only doing this for the villagers at this point. I'm actually really scared that the whole village is going to go ahead and die because of the spawners I've gone ahead and spawned. Well, let's go and spawn them on this dock right around here. The rocket creepers. Now, I think these guys are going to go ahead and either shoot me in the air or themselves. Whoa! Okay, that was mad. I didn't realize I was going to go ahead and do that. I thought for a second we could have survived that one very easily. But I don't want to leave any creepers roaming around. So I'm going to go ahead and try and kill them. And hopefully we should be able to survive this. Perfect. And good. Okay, let's do this into the water. Ah, we're completely missed. Well, let's go and spawn the bombing creeper. Now, I think this one is going to be really scary. So we've got to go ahead and spawn this one. Maybe next to some mobs. Hopefully the mobs will go ahead and confuse this creeper so much. Well, I'm going to do them right here. Here we go. Get ready. <laughs> Whoa! TNT, run! Whoa! Okay, that was crazy. I think we've done it, though. But sadly, so many sheep have had to die. I'm sorry, sheep! <laughs> okay, this is turning out to be such a mad day. And next up, we have some anti-creepers. Wait, I thought anti-creepers mean friendly mobs. This is not friendly whatsoever. Okay, they're going ahead and changing our whole world. Where are we right now? Okay, maybe our best bet is if we just go ahead and die. I'm just going to keep on jumping until we die. Well, I'm glad that worked. Okay, let's just keep on going. I don't know what happened around there that it seems like it's gone ahead and put us in a dome that would have taken me forever to get out of. Well, guys, let's keep on going with the furnace creepers. Now, I have a feeling I know exactly what these guys are going to do. They're going to go ahead and just spawn loads of fire and try and burn everything down. So I'm going to go and try and kill these guys. Perfect and good. I think the villagers are going to be happy though. We've gone ahead and used up all the spawners. I think they would have been really sad if maybe another evil villager got these spawners and they went ahead and killed every single village in the whole neighborhood. Do you know what? I might head to the desert because it seems to be a safer place right now and totally away from that crazy village. Okay, I'm going to spawn the dispensary creeper. There we go. And perfect. Watch out. Good. <laughs> Wait. Are they going ahead and throwing potions at me? I hate this so much at this point. Perfect. No. Okay, there we go. And good. I'm just hoping these guys can go ahead and kill each other. Here we go. Ah, we've died to the dispensary creeper. This is awful. And wait, why is the whole world on fire? Okay, at this point, I don't even feel sorry for the villagers. I think they had it on themselves. Villager, excuse me, I'm going to spawn three crazy creepers right inside here. And hopefully we can just leave them right inside and we'll never have them to blow up ever again. Close the door. <laughs> okay, now. Oh, well, I guess all the villagers survived, so that's not so bad. Villager, I'll remake your house somehow. Hopefully we can go ahead and fix this. I think all your blocks should hopefully be here. Well, guys, after this video, I'm going to have to go ahead and save the whole village and build everything over again. But still, we have so many creepers to go and do. So I'm going to go and spawn the magnetic creeper. I think this one's going to be a really nice one. Wait, they go ahead and drag you in. Look, with the redstone, they're going ahead and trying to kill me. Thankfully, we didn't spawn that one next to any villagers. Huh. 
I just wish the villagers knew exactly what we did for them. Because we've done such a good job in making sure they all stay safe. Well, now that they've gone ahead and lost most of their emeralds, I think we should keep on going. And let's go and take out the last few spawners. Okay, I did notice we did have... Where is it? A withering keeper. I'm going to go ahead and spawn these and hit them into the lava. Wait! They can walk on lava! This is awful! No! And it backfired! They hit us into the water! Okay, we've got to be super quick. I'm going to go and spawn the baby creeper. Because as soon as we spawn every single one, we can leave this village and never come back ever again. There we go, and perfect. But I do need to get inside the water. Ah, oh, perfect. Wait! No! <laughs> They're a lot smarter than we think! Okay, how do we get out of here? Villagers, I need your help! How do I get out? Or maybe my only choice is if we go ahead, spawn some more creepers, and hopefully we should be okay. Perfect. There we go, guys. Get ready for this. <laughs> this is mental. Ah, we died from the withering creepers. Well, it seems like everyone in this world now is going to go ahead and fight against each other, which is absolutely awful. Perfect and good. No. Ah, this is crazy. Well, maybe my best bet is if we just go ahead, spawn every single creeper that's left, and we just try and survive. Some of these are even a couple years old. These villagers must have been holding onto these spawners for such a long time. Those guys had pumpkins on their head. Okay. Wait, they're still here. Run. <laughs> They've been following me for ages. Okay. I'm just so glad we can actually survive these crazy attacks. Well, let's keep on going and let me spawn the llama creeper. Ah, this is going to be such a crazy day. Do you know what? I just want to get it over with at this point. I'm going to spawn the creepers of the 4th of July. We're a little bit late, but definitely a good time to go ahead and spawn these guys. Yes! <laughs> awesome! Well, we only have two more. The puff creeper, which I'm assuming gets to the same size as the chest. No wonder they went ahead and got a big chest. Well, that was actually kind of crazy. But the final one we have is the witch, which I don't even want to spawn. I'm going to spawn it right here and hit it back. Good and perfect. Come on. Good. Okay, perfect. That went ahead and worked. There we go. Now, come on. Blow up. Down there, though. Good. And then the final one. Let's get it and hit it. Now, perfect. Oh, I'm so glad we survived all those attacks. But the withering creeper is still trying to go ahead and go after me, which is absolutely awful. Well, guys, I guess we're going to have to keep on running. Trying to survive this crazy life, but all the villagers have gone ahead and done such a good job. So guys, I will see you soon in the crazy Minecraft video. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe down below, the button is red, and don't forget to press the notifications bell. So guys, I'll see you all soon. Peace out.